the, the explosion of art things like music, music, and even sexuality, and because before those these years, like before the 60s, uh, in France it was like in the 19th century, it was really old stuff, like really old fashioned. But then, after the explosion of all the art and like I, like I said, sexuality it was a great advance, like a great step. Also, just like the idea of movements, like real movements, with a lot of like, I don't know, just movements in culture just seem more fragmented now. And in the 70s, it, it felt more solidified, be it music, a movement in music, a movement in art, a political movement. It was, it, there was something more solidified about it. They had to fight to be heard in a way that you don't really have to fight to be heard now, but then again, who's listening now? I don't know. In that way, just the idea of how a movement moves, it's so different now. And in a lot of ways, more difficult because it's too easy. Yeah, yeah, like, exactly. Like today, it's, there's so many ways to be, in, to be heard by people, like with internet and all the way of communication that we have today. <clears throat> it's like it's more difficult to hear people because there's so many. Yeah. So many people can just say everything about everything all the time. That is too much. So, uh, yeah. And the it's quite liberating to think about a letter. Exactly. I still do. I yeah. still do. I still do. <laughs> yeah, it's just the, the fact that you, you, you just know that the person is going to receive a letter is that you have to be, you have to say something in the letter, like the fact that you receive a mail 10 seconds after you send it, it's like, I can say everything, but in, in a letter you have to be honest. You don't really have to explain some of the language to you, like bourgeois and, you know, you know that kind of thing, the, some of the language of politics at the time. Um, not really, I think. Um, no. 